Hello lads and welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be sharing 10 things you may or may not know about Mountain Blade including tricks, glitches and just some odd things. All of these can be used in Napoleonic Wars but some can be used on Native Warband and on other mods such as Persistent World. I hope you enjoy. Now the first one is quite a small trick which I don't see used quite often yet it helps me a lot when I'm group fighting. I'm talking about the zoom out. As you can see here, this is the before after shot of when you don't zoom out, so normally when you launch up the game, and this is after. As you can see, your uh, vision is quite widely spread out. Here on the screen now is uh, four YouTube channels which I've seen mainly which do not use this, which I think needs to be brought to their attention. I'm not sure if they just choose not to use it because it's their personal preference or just purely because they don't know about it. But in the top left, as you can see, that's Hayes, um, as known as Drake Gaming on YouTube. Top right is the Pointless Shows, more commonly known as 15E Major Tim. Bottom left is Heresy UK, well known, and bottom right is Python TP. Now, the second one is a lot harder, I find, and. I don't know whether to call it a glitch or a trick, I'm going to leave that up to you. I personally think it's a glitch, I suppose. Um, but if you hold W and run straight at your opponent, you can actually hit them twice in one stun by speeding up your attack. This is obviously very risky because if you mistime it, then you can only just get a poke and then your opponent has practically a free kill. The way this works, and I'm sure you guys have noticed that maybe when you're in a line battle, if you run straight at a friendly back and uh, you're running straight into them, you actually can speed yourself up as you run past them. I'm sure that some people that have played this game for a decently long time will actually have noticed that. And this is how this works. If you run straight into your opponent when attacking, you can speed up your second attack and essentially speed yourself up. The third one is a bit of an odd one. For some reason, the construction hammer, which the sapper class can spawn with, has the range of an officer sword and uses the officer sword template. I don't see why it wasn't given the butter knife range, as this would seem more logical. Well, that's that's mountain blade for you, isn't it? Now the fourth one is a bit of a weird glitch and will only appear client side, which means only the user can see this. Now this glitch allows you to shoot twice and the way it works is that if you aim and then fire at the same time as you press the X key, you can actually shoot more than twice. Um, I've only managed to do it to about three times but I'm not sure what the maximum is. Um, you also need to note that the first shot that's fired, or the second or all subsequent shots, which isn't the last one, doesn't actually do any damage as it's just the appearance of the shot. Now, the fifth one is a really weird glitch and actually leads on from the fourth one, as if you can uh, successfully complete the double shot, for some reason it then allows you to run and reload at the same time. Now, number six is another sapper trick. The way this works is that if you build several Shevex to freezes in a straight column upwards, like here, and then remove the bottom to middle, so it cuts half of your head off, shown here, you can actually jump and teleport to the top of the structure. This works with all heights and angles as long as you delete the right amount of Shevex to freezes, otherwise it won't work and you'll just end up jumping. Number 7 is quite an odd one and uh, it's involving cavalry attacks. The way this works is that if you hold an attack and then dismount your horse while still holding that same attack, you actually keep the same attack animation as if you were still mounted on the horse. This works both left and right attacks. And now I've been playing Mountain Blade since 2012 and I've never seen this done before. And I quite like how it can lead to some weird and funny poses. Hold me close, don't let me go. Number eight is more of a common glitch, but basically, if you uh, unequip your musket and either punch left or hold the punch left, and then um, re-equip your musket, switch it from shooting mode to melee mode by pressing X. It makes a really weird animation and sound when facing a wall. This works with infantry muskets, rifles, cavalry muskets and musketoons I'm pretty sure. Number 9 is relatively common but still can be quite obscure. This glitch is shown when you ride any type of horse, you press P to surrender and then freeze yourself so you glitch under the horse. If you then right click to cancel the surrender, you can move freely around while floating at the bottom of the horse. Pretty weird. And 
finally, number 10 is just a useful trick. If you put your infantry musket into melee mode by pressing X and then press Z to crouch, you can actually brace the musket to kill horses. Keep in mind you can only kill one horse at a time as there is a refresh rate. Most people know this in PW as uh, it works with all pikes and pikes. Um, so I just finished editing and realised I forgot to mention this glitch, so I'm just going to class this as 10.1. Um, basically, if you build a ramp like the one shown, then back a cannon on top of it, you can actually point the barrel straight down and fire, or straight up and fire, and the cannonball path is actually really messed up due to this. Thanks again for watching, um, commentary over the footage was actually a lot easier than editing text in, so I'm sorry if the cringe is too much for you. Uh, all of the uh, video clips of the different YouTubers for number one will be linked in the description along with the channel. I'd also like to mention that um, these are not based on best to worst, so number one is not the best or number ten is not the best, they're all just done randomly. Um, thank you uh, to Spastic1 and 2 for helping me make this video. Um, and hopefully I'll see you guys in the next one. Reset the map. <coughs> yep. I just choked on a bit pop. <coughs> Alright. Spawning spawning up in host. Oh, hang on, fucking hell. Mech, Python would use after like this is a fucking tank one. <laughs> <laughs> I have never ever seen that before. What? <laughs> oh fucking one laugh you prick Alright do it again do it again Do it again Shut the fuck up baggins <laughs>